Hi, I'm Rachel, and today we're going to be going over a tutorial for Algebra 2 logarithms. So, the basics for a log, right? Let's say we have log 2 of 8. The base is 2. Basically, it's very similar to exponents, right? We're thinking, well, how many times do you have to multiply 2 together to get 8? If we have 2 times 2 times 2, right, that's 4 times 2 is 8, there's 3 2's, right? Just like how 2 to the 3rd equals 8, the answer of this problem, log base 2 of 8, is going to be 3. Um, it's also good to know that if you have a log of anything without a base written, like log of 600, the, that's a standard log where we just assume that this number here is 10, so that just means log base 10. There's also natural logs, right, which look like this, ln of, you know, some number, and that's actually where there's an e here, right, but we don't need to write the e, we just write it ln. There's also a few different properties that are good to know. It's good to know that log of x divided by y equals log of x minus log of y. Log of x times y is log of x plus log of y. And log of x to the y equals y log x. So you just bring it in front as a coefficient. Those are properties that are all very similar to exponents, if you know your exponent properties, that are just good to memorize. I'm Rachel, and thanks for learning with us today.